Let's beat this fucking game, dude. Yeah. I'm a little upset that we can't, like, take the guy in ourselves. We gotta, we gotta call people over to this island. What if they don't want to come? What if they can't swim? What if a mysterious stick bug shows up and kills them in the middle of the ocean? What if... I gotta tell you, I did not imagine it as a giant stick bug. I really thought, based on Lena's description, it was gonna be, like, one reed. Yeah. Like, just I, a single reed. Very much agreed. I thought for sure it was gonna be a tiny little guy. Um... But honestly, I think it being a big freakazoid is a lot cooler, so I can't complain about that. Definitely. Although, also, and you said this earlier, like, that that trap was not going to work. No, that trap was not going to do <laughs> shit. Um, I will say, uh, again, glad that motherfucker was there, though. I'm glad he showed up. I was waiting yep. for him. Oh, yeah. MF. The waves yep, you were right. Dark. All right, well. Oh, yeah, we did good shit here, detective. Thank you, Kuno. The skiff rocks I, gently under your weight. I have no idea what to expect anymore. The though, like, is uneventful when this when this uh, like chat ends, is the game just be like, "You did it." Of conversation on the water, there is someone in land. Kim's yeah. waiting for me. You reach the jetty and climb out um, of the skiff. I hope it's it can't be Kim. No it's one been was less for than me. a day. I was lied to. Yeah, that's a good point. It's been it's like nice. five hours or something. Yeah, um, and he got shot oh. in the. But, oh. Thank you. I thought and completely forgot to even wanted to think about the Puda Madre motherfuckers, so here they are. Okay, okay. Yeah. Harry, you're bleeding all over the place. You're half dead. This was the asshole guy, right? Who wouldn't yeah, tell this me guy anything? Was a, okay. This guy was a real dick on the phone. Yeah. Oh! I was thinking of the guy that was sitting in the whirling in rags the whole game that was just like... You're a fucking annoying that guy. Is completely no, I don't think so. Unless he was wearing yeah. a wig. No, yeah, blonde. yeah. You, I, th I think you're right. Yeah. This is the yeah. man with sunglasses. From the what? Blonde. Holy fuck! But where are his sunglasses? But this guy was also the guy that was a dick on the phone at the beginning. Yeah. You're the man with wow. sunglasses. Wow. That's right. And you're bleeding. It's so rare that we're both right. <laughs> uh, <laughs> yeah. And saying contradictory things too. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Let me sell my back, right? Oh, <laughs> All boy. right. Who are you, Hello. people? Um, Trent Heilerstein. I believe we've met on several occasions. Oh, this was the fucking nerdy guy outside the fellow building, right? Who gave us like a insane backstory yes. about stuff. Your goddamn bot now. Yes, it was. Out. And this is your special task force, or what's left of it. Special consultant Trent Heilerstein. If you're my partner, why didn't you just fucking tell me that, dickhead? Yeah, that would have been so easy. I Maybe spent was 20 Kim. minutes asking you who I am, and you laughed at me and was a fucking piece of shit. We've come to scrape what's left of you off the pavement. Kim's definitely a better oh. partner, for sure. Shit, wait. Oh. Task force, cool? On the Kuno? We just came from the fucking island? Listen, Kuno. Harry and I are old friends from way back. Kuno, don't go! Let you guys have a moment. Won't be long. I just need to talk to Harry about some of the things I think he's done wrong lately. Kuno, don't go. I need your oh, help. Kuno. Sounds like you're in some shit. Kuno. Kuno. Uh, he's, uh, well. We're not forgetting about anything. Look at you. What's it with both hands? Holy shit. This guy's fucking cracked. That's a crack. powerful point. I don't know if I've ever pointed at somebody with both hands. Like you need a yeah. Organ Unless I'm doing finger guns, this which I've definitely this done. This guy's oh, truly it. lost it. Let's not get into that. All right, well. Harry, we want to help you. Trant, I believe this is where you come in. Trant? What a fucking stupid name. Um, I don't quite know what I'm doing here. I was asked to participate as an expert. I think I need to manage your expectations a little. I'm at best an enthusiast in cognitive science. My background is in something else entirely. I engage in neurology on a merely theoretical level. In fact, I should probably get going. <laughs> no, Trump, it's too late. You're part of this shit now. What have you got to say for yourself, shit kid? Shit kid? What an interesting Monica. Um, yeah, I don't know. What's a shit kid? What a rude you, guy. Shit kid, that's you. Despite all that you've done, the deserter, the fazbear, the <laughs> Des Despite all that no, I've done? Yeah. Of all that you've done. I did a great job. The cafeteria manager you fucked over told us where you went. We fucked um, over? 
Um, we saved the whirling in rags. Yeah, he was nice to me. Shit, kid. He didn't betray you. He just told us the direction you went in. Who's Sylvie? I, I don't remember wow. hooking Sylvie up with Gart, but I guess I did a good job. You, yeah, we we did. We uh, we told Gart that uh, she liked them when we talked Trench. to her on the phone on the he radio. Didn't that. In fact, the that funnily enough, Zay, that episode went live today, the day that we're recording it this. Fire. It, which in the day you're hearing this is going to be a long, <laughs> a long fucking time, time ago. A long time from now. <laughs> um. Yeah, there was a fire. Yeah, it was sick. I knew it. Didn't I tell you, Trant? I told you it was a shit kid. The line is from Lu Jiatun's Mirova 82, isn't it? About girl-child communism. This guy's Did still on his shit, huh? Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Same as when he was talking to what I assume was a fake child it now? Was a yeah. Poet, the Lu child was a damn plant. Who in the 50s? Of the last <laughs> just fucking just insulindian phasmids everywhere disguised okay. as children as reeds as buildings all right well let's not go down the list you you're not the man with sunglasses at all you're not even blonde yeah he was wearing a wig one of the most uh powerful skills i would say that you and i have developed over the course of this playthrough is the ability to talk about things exactly 10 seconds before they fucking happen. Yeah. Any um, truly wild. Look, Harry, you're insane now. There's one less person for me and everyone else but to rely on. You can still rely on me, I solved the case. Too yeah. For you to realize who he was. Uh, I, I suspect did something you, was off. Or did you literally not recognize my face? We've been partners for how long, Harry? Don't answer that. You don't remember. Absolutely no idea. If we've been partners for a long time, this guy's got to be on the payroll too, right? Yeah, potentially. Unless that was not true. Cause I, I thought these were going to be the Puta Madre guys, but now they just actually don't seem that hostile? I don't know. Yeah, I, I shouldn't should jump to a conclusion yet. Faced woman. It's Judith Mino. I was assigned to your unit two months ago. I thought we were friends. Uh, we're still friends. Okay. Because you're my commanding officer, <laughs> I I really want to respect you. I want us to have a normal. S sorry, relationship. sorry for calling you the yeah. worst-faced woman. That will never yeah. happen, Jude. He's the rudest man on earth. He's the reason why the rest of us have to take sensitivity training, and I hate sensitivity training. Yes, I'm Tran Heilerstam. I never said I wasn't Tran Heilerstam. All right. Well, what's up? He's with just the like kid? he's yeah. he's slurring his son. first and last name together more every time he says it. No. Yeah. I was just interested Sounds like the, the Grinch. Building and the Martinez beachhead, and Mikhail wanted to see Martinez. It was a coincidence. Oh, I like the idea that his child was a plant. What indeed? Me too. I was asked to share my take on some of the more obscure theories developed in Königstein in the 30s, like partial psychotraumatic amnesia. Group personality theory. He's here to see if you're insane. He is smart. Let's move on. All right. Well, I mean, I guess these guys aren't. As, I thought for sure I was about to get mowed down on the street, but maybe we're fine. Duped. Hey, here's a brilliant idea. Don't be a morbid drunk, and you won't be duped so easily. Uh, <laughs> Kuno, tell me who you I mean, are. Fuck, pig. The name's Gorn. Not Kuno. What? It's Lamer. Are you fucking kidding me? Oh my god. You think Kuno was a fake name? Oh my god. Try not to shit yourself, please. Holy shit. We're getting blasted by everyone right now. Yeah, nobody's anybody anymore. <laughs> yeah, major crimes unit. And all you know, Dubois and Vicomar. Kim's name better be fucking else. Kim. I'm pissed. Uh, who else is in it? Refresh your memory. It's a goddamn major crimes unit. There's you, me, Jude. Drunk fucking Heidelstown and Guillaume Baby. I'm technically just a civilian advisor. Oh, oh he's the mentalist. Friend. You're part of this shit show. Guillaume Baby? Oh, that's an interesting story, actually. Guillaume Baby is a police reporter who joined our team. He was really good. Then he left because he lost faith in your ability to lead the unit. Well, yeah, I mean, he might have had some Other good foresight there. Too. Good, smart people. People we won't get back. 
Only me and this really patient patrol officer are still here. And Tron, because I'm forcing him to stay. Is this Guillaume bevy blonde and partial to sunglasses? See? There. He's getting it. I was impersonating him. Look at me, I'm G-Bevy. It was going to be funny, but then you really did have brain damage. So not so much anymore. <laughs> All right. Do. It's a major crimes unit. We cleared the desk of cases, so Precinct 41 doesn't look like the worst station in town. We are shit to wow. now, Harry. Because of so you. he's he's just mad that the station looks bad? I don't know, dude. I've seen a lot yeah. worse things than that recently. Also, like, you could have been solving crimes this whole time. You didn't need to come here just to laugh at me for like a week, bro. It seems like you're a little bit responsible for the situation too. All right, so fucking yeah, back he off. Doesn't... Bad priorities, I would say, on Jean yeah. Vickermeyer. Where have we been? We've been fucking off as far as I remember. You told us to fuck off. You said we're cramping your style. Your detective. Girl. I fuck did everything. probably say that. Oh, we, mm, we probably did say that. Yeah, die. probably. I don't explicitly remember it, but it does sound like a dialogue option we would get. Yeah, yes, I agree. Take him on a creepy boat trip in the middle of fucking March. <laughs> I didn't abduct him. He came. He went there by himself. Yeah. Kuno is a cop, Jean. <laughs> Why didn't you detect her oh, die then? It's cool you're saying that. Aesthetic somehow. You were crying when we got here. Breaking things. You said we were going into the abyss. Now that I do believe I said, yeah. None of yeah. us wanted to see the abyss. So we fucked off. <sighs> like you told us to. The bells on That's fair. We actually have more evidence now that we're going into the abyss than we did before, I think. Go. Yeah. How bad is it? A categorical truth instead of just metaphorical. Well, mm -hmm. he doesn't mm -hmm. have visible tremors. He talks without slurring. He can drive a boat. He can Stand levitate near a boat. Reasoning. All good signs, but complete <laughs> retrograde emotion. Yeah. Episodic and semantic. Meaning, you forgot both who you are and the definitions of money, Isola, Pell, and Soul. As displayed in the station call, our interactions with him and... I don't want to I'm actually glad stage, Rhetoric explained that because I thought before, this guy meant Harry that uh, we're being was. semantic and that's it's a bad sign. Interesting. <laughs> yeah. Interesting? Yes, interesting. I have my theories, but I would like to hear Harry's thoughts first. Harry, what do you think happened to you? <laughs> Neurologically, psychologically, and why not socioeconomically? <laughs> I mean, I think six is the actual answer, but I want to hit him with number four, honestly. I want to talk about the yeah. Damn, I want to talk about the yeah. Damn hole. Talk about the hole. They're gonna be like, no, you're stupid. Don't give me that shit. Probably. To the twenty centimeter hole in your brain. Mm -hmm. Sure. Shut the this fuck up, John. I hate this guy. I see how it folds into itself neatly. Yeah, I mean, fuck you. Yes, yes. Anomaly. Look, I get it. In your delirium, you came up with an anthropogenic explanation for why you're such an insane drug. And I understand. I've been there. Perhaps it's not because he's a petulant teenager in a 40-year-old man's body. Perhaps it's pale. Hey, wounds. are we does that perhaps mean we're 40? Physical. I think we knew that. Or perhaps oh. it can be cured with mass. Well, never mind. Yeah, we're 40. Think, no, that's unlikely. He's probably just an asshole. A drunk asshole who pretends to have amnesia to get out of shit. I mean, I pretended you know really fucking well. I deluded even myself, so... Detective Something I just realized is that uh, we've been playing this game for so long that some of the amnesia our character has is actually true oh, for yeah, us. That's just, that's just I definitely don't remember some of the stuff that we did oh, like absolutely. two days ago in this game. Yeah, for sure. Yes, that, that's, of times. that's by design. After some of the more you, you fall into one of those holes of just non-stop unending kids. exposition dialogue and it's designed Blackout. to make you forget stuff yeah absolutely so you don't remember not remembering beautiful uh we looked into the mural interesting those cases were hard on you interesting so at first he dipped his toes into it prepared that's where he would have gotten the idea yes practice and then he used alcohol to get there, so to speak. Wait, so he's saying I tested getting amnesia before and then went full on with it? What do you mean? That's pretty <laughs> fucking sick, dude. Well, here's my theory. What if this is an absolutely normal reaction to the world we're living in? 
What if this is not a significant anomaly at all? Something to be explained, approached as a defect. Look at the sensory input here. Look at the ruins, the neon. Listen to the radio, the multitudes, the people. Live here for 40 years. As a police detective, he's like a magnetic reader on the world team, to borrow a known metaphor. Harry's I don't. I don't know that instant. metaphor. <laughs> totally. Me Sorry. Neither. Sorry, my man. Hardwired to the free market. He just needed for its end. Okay, Trump. Thank you. That's absolutely meaningless. I'm glad. Will he will not be able to work in major crimes unit? Is he a cretin now? He really just wants me to get back to work, dude, and be He's a good leader. A oh yeah. And he is able to do work, if not in his previous leadership role, then as a line detective. I'm ready to lead again. No one even mentioned that. <laughs> I misphrased my question. It should have been, is he able to put his clothes on and use the body? Or do we need to get him on a disability pension? They can keep that pension. You're rock solid. You can put your clothes on. Oh. That was a challenging success check wow. to be able to, put, to know that I can put my clothes on. Hell yeah. No, nothing. Now we're just going to stand here. Yeah, yeah. Just stand there. It's cool. No, no, we discussed that. What the fuck did you do to a motor carriage? Why is it there, Harry? Look, Lie. you already Just know I forgot, dude. <laughs> awesome. I like the one. I like the one. Wow, a lot of these are actually good. I like yeah. the one where you just pretend you have no idea what they're talking about. The time had come to heal his sons. I don't know. I don't know what's doing there. It's still my like Jacob Ur. I don't even remember who that is. Jacob Post? Me neither. Hold on. In the ocean? Yes. In the ocean, under the sea, our work vehicle with fishing clams and another sea ship. I don't know, man. I do. You drove it into the water. Everyone on the street saw you do it. It's going to be a local landmark too, on the brochure. Thank you for fucking us, Harry. But I'm like, I'm also like a local hero, so like that's not all yeah. bad. Yeah. Think about that. We've Thank done a lot. Forty-five thousand riyad of police property that's coming out of my pay slip. You know that, right? You're gonna get fired, and I'm gonna pay till I die. Bro, I, every single time I remember something from my big encyclopedia brain, I get $2. Just fucking, like, sign me up for Jeopardy, and even if I lose, I'm gonna come out with, like, a couple hundred bucks, do it a few times. All I'm saying, it's a pretty good scheme, you gotta admit. It doesn't matter. Oh, yeah. Your badge, Harry. Show me your badge. Uh... <laughs> oh, hey, we actually have our badge. <laughs> yeah, but I want to clack, click the heels of my boots. We're not armor cops. We're yes. cop cops. People don't know us by your armor. They know us by our badges. You called in and said you lost yours. Have you yeah, we have our badge. No, sure. I like the idea that you can lie and say you badge. don't have it. Your eager fingers can't sustain a grip on the <laughs> Oh, no! no. This, is, this is so sad. Nice. We got skill points, might nice. as well cash them out, right? I mean... <laughs> Hell yeah. Not today, badge. Behold, my badge. And your gun? Uh-oh. As if having... No, 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 no. Gun on natural state. Don't, don't ask me about that shit. We no. were in a fight, yeah, Jean. Maybe you can philosophize your way out of it. Things don't matter, people do. I, I upgraded my gun to a rifle. Upgraded it. I don't care about your weapon mania, Harry. I only care about your official sidearm, which you lost. Yeah, but look at the cool gun I have. Yeah, this is this is good. Try and distract him. Fuck, John. He's, he's not Get falling distracted. for it. Um, I knew it. I told you we didn't have it. Look, if I could have gone back in time, I would have picked the skill check to shoot the guy in the face instead of throwing my gun at him, okay? But it seemed like yeah. it made sense at the time. This isn't cause for we speech. thought we were going to get another chance to shoot him, but we didn't. I thought I was going to get another chance to shoot him. Oh, I would say it's very bad. You're drunk like a bum, Harry. Please, put the I... rifle away before you kill someone. I literally drank alcohol one time on day one. How yeah, the I fuck actually... could one beer make me drunk still a week later? This I actually do take issue with because we have not drank alcohol certainly not today in the I, game I, I again there's it was no the way first day for that task that was have a drink i literally drank one time yeah and also when we licked the rum off the counter but uh beyond that no oh, wait, drinks I, I can just lie i forgot about so that 
for God to drink. I don't buy it. Why do you smell like a corpse? Because I was well, just we dead. Showered. That's, that's, that's true. also a good point. On, you're gonna cut up some slack. Pig's been working hard, digging through the guts of corpses and shit, getting shot and shit. Uh, yeah, I had a bit of a week. A bit of a week. You're drunk. John, I swear to fucking God, if you call us drunk one more time, he's, we're gonna punch you out. He's literally running down the checklist of things we did to say how bad of a job we did. <laughs> yeah. Like, it's a checklist of like, have a drink, check mark, he's gonna call you drunk. Let, didn't arrest Klossi, check mark, he's gonna say you let Klossi get away. Well, what, what, what's next? Uh, found a working class husband, check mark, I did a great job, fuck you. We've read the report, yeah. sorry. You've known Kitsuhagi's. We know. Um. That doesn't matter. The oxygen holocaust. I don't know. I don't, I don't think I'm gonna tell him about the oxygen holocaust, honestly. Uh, yeah, yeah, that's I, fair. I just say I did the right thing. Fuck you guys. Oh, well. If she was nice. I'm not even gonna get into the other suspect. Right. Who also is Let Ruby escape. Check mark. Oh. Calls you out and letting Ruby escape. <laughs> she was gonna blow her yeah. brains out, dude. Okay, Dude, well. I don't know what for him. That's no. Stuff. That's nothing. No. That's a anecdote. This does his feel like plan, the end game. His plan isn't gonna work because idiot Doom Spiral isn't his name of the signature he wanted. So I subverted his goals. Eight yeah. Fuck you. Heal my morale. Fuck the you. Streets are literally red with blood. All right. Well, that. He's barely clinging to life in the hospital. Look. Okay. This. The, no, no. This part is true. <laughs> that the skill checks didn't go my way. I'll admit it. Yo, yeah. I'll stop you right there. Book face. It's Kuno time. I want Kuno. Oh, I want yeah. some fucking Kuno time, dude. Kuno, go haul wild on this, dude. Yeah. No, you've explained enough, pig. Kuno takes care. Yes, of absolutely. Kuno, light Fuck him yeah. up. Yeah. Kuno, go off. No, those guys were all. <laughs> <in the> army. <laughs> oh. Oh no. Oh no. So yeah. So Kuno's dick. You don't. So. Know me. So yeah. Suck so Kuno's dick. You don't know what happened, dear. You don't know this shit. I, I wish Kuno had not led with three slurs, you know? Because well, it would be easier to root for him. Honestly, we should have seen that coming. It's Kuno. <laughs> yeah, you're right. Now, Kuno wasn't there. Right, you're getting this. Kuno was breaking up with Kuno's <gasps> Oh no, I didn't know that, Kuno. I'm sorry. When Kuno got there, Pig had fucking cleaned up, blood and ruin. Wait, Kuno, hang on. You're not backing me up right now so well. Those dinky fuckers save this shit. Martin ain't shit. I see he's mourning and shit. His main pig got semi wasted. Sent to the boo boo reveal. <laughs> Kuno steps up. Kuno fucking fills those shoes. Big boy shoes. Detective Kuno. He comes to a sudden abrupt stop. Are you done? Yo, Kuno feels like you weren't really listening to Kuno. You were hearing, but you weren't listening. In the armor boys came to Martin Ace to fuck shit up. Hardy boys or whatever the fuck they are. They were telling everyone and their mum how they wasted one of those armor fucks. It was always gonna go down like that. My pig stepped up, got fucked in the leg for it, sacrifice style. Not bad, Kuno. Could be a little <laughs> shorter. <though>. Yeah, <laughs> I mean, I, I, all dialogue with Kuno from, like from since he's joined our party is just making me think what Kim would have said. And I imagine in most cases it's very actually very similar. Like Kim probably would have done it with less slurs, but probably would have yeah. defended us and said we did a good job. So yes, agreed. He was in the fight. Second, you dinky fucking asshole. This I wonder what Kim would have like. This oink oink motherfucker solved that shit. I wonder what Jean would have said to Kim too, because he's pretty, he's like pretty dismissive of Kuno. Yeah. But like, would he be rude to Kim, or would he listen to Kim? Because Kim's pop. All right. Yeah. He's not ten. He's fucking twelve. Kuno's been around, seen shit, real shit. He's not a fucking toddler. Yes. Go you home know. or fuck off. Really, I. You may want to rethink your strategy of letting a twelve oh, present your case. <laughs> How yeah. dare you? Point is, we solved the case. Yeah. Fucked up grandpa, did it? Fucking grandpa in the woods or some shit? <laughs> Old shit? Kuno doesn't know about that. Look, the real shit here is... Yeah, yeah, straggler, sure. Are you getting this smart shit? The old fuck killed him. Confessed to it too. We got him snitching on himself. Popo style. A straggler. From the revolution. Yeah, fucko. He's on the island right now. In a coma or some shit. 
Oh, and we also got the gun. Gun of the killer shit. You know what I mean? Now, let's get our big boy shit on. <laughs> let's get our big boy shit on. That's what I say every time I go into the bathroom, man. I'm like, oh, I gotta get my big boy shit on. Yeah. Here big we go. Shit. We're taking them all down. We're cleaning this shit up. Now, listen up, soup book. You're gonna shit yourself because it's gonna get wacko natural. Wait, it's not going to get the. It's not going to get wacko natural. I don't know. I don't know what wacko natural means, man. I I want to agree with the wacko naturaling though. I think. There's a fucking four ton man. Yeah. On the oh yeah. Oh yeah. There was a, That was pretty wacko oh. natural. Oh. What? Oh. See now, I think I don't think we should have told them about this. Yeah. They're not gonna believe it. Yeah. No, this is like the biggest moment in history right now. You wanna fucking listen to what's coming out of Kuno's mouth? We saw the giant insect. White as fuck, literally the Insulindian phasmid or some shit. It's Saying mantis hearing it was Kuno use its official name is really Mantia. out of style for Kuno. This fucking old popo discovered it. Me and the pig bacon discovered a new species. It was beautiful. It was. You ain't seen this kind of animal before. Fucking minute. Yeah, I, I'm worried this is gonna uh, counteract yeah, our reveal of the actual murder. Undo it all. This case, yeah. This oh yeah. Vampire shit. This ugly shit, it's nothing. We saw a ghost, a real life ghost. Like he fucking proved Fuck. ghosts are real. It's that big. <laughs> Who know, pro or Kim would probably not have talked about yeah. the phasmid. He's gonna Why cry. Are you fucking shitting yourselves? What's wrong? Did he just say insulindian phasmid? I don't know. I don't doubt. Harry, did you just pick up some myelin perm and pin it on him? No, no! You aren't fucking listening the bomb is nothing this is science history here it was the insulindian phasmid it's connected to the shit tell him i i feel like i, I want to say it's not connected to the case although it kind of actually was because it was like melting the dude's mind and potentially made him shoot but he has own motives unrelated to that right so i don't know please yeah you have to have more than just some mantis the straggler stick to that you said you solved the murder it's not going well. Present something now. Something sane and clear. Make your I have the gun in the no, scope. There was a giant insect, and they have to understand that. You will find proof. I also Don't started a nightclub. The killer of a motive. Uh, oh, oh man. We get to just talk about everything we did. This is this is the like this is the Mass Effect final conversation. Yeah. It feels like. Big time. Um it may only be a small thing, but I found a man's jacket. Uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell him about the the assassination of the what? of uh, on behalf of Edgar Clare. Yeah, 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 yeah. For yeah. the sake of political neutrality, I would like to not partake in anything union related. This has to be good stuff for him to backpedal out of it at first mention. What the fuck, you puss! This will send you flying. Trust Kuno. Grandpa laid down some real shit, conspiracy style. If that's even remotely true, then a clandestine investigation will be required. It smells like bad news to me. A classic shit kit case that'll get people killed or fired. All right. Well, let's. Uh, I guess. Tell him about my nightclub. Hmm. What was that? Yeah. It sounded like you set up a nightclub in the church. Yeah, we did. Uh, we had to investigate I, the two. <laughs> yes. Uh, uh, hit yes. two unexplored. Yeah, yeah, That's yeah. That's great. Anthroponaut is a great new career for you. After police officer. I don't care. Go live in the fucking veil. Get off the chair, shit. It's making you sound crazy. <laughs> okay, sorry. Sorry, Kuno. I guess you would know what sounds crazy or not. Lilianovich. A revolutionary matronym. The custom started in Grad, where they have oh boy. Krasovich, Larsovich, etc. The revolutionaries saw this as a chauvinist activism, so I, they used matronyms. Dude, right from the I have no I could fucking idea what this dude this is saying. Fucking inst instantly, instantly gloss over as soon as Trant starts talking. Just like, after the glossy eyed. But not before making it this guy needs to not pipe up. This detail bolsters your straggler theory. Oh, okay, he's helping us though, oh, so okay, I appreciate okay, okay. that. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I take it back. Thank you, Trant. Okay, Trant. Thank you. I get it. <laughs> Harry. I said that. No more giant insects. You said you have a motive. Okay, Jean's starting to like calm down a little bit. I can't fucking. <laughs> Kuno. Kuno. Get the it's okay. Line. 
You could use this help. Um. Yeah. Kuno, keep your head in the game. I, right. Yeah. yeah. Kuno's in it. All right, cool. We've refocused Fuck our yeah. Kuno. Uh, Hell yeah. The, he was. It was an act of jealousy. I mean, that's all it was, right? Yeah. Jealousy. Yeah, basically. He's what? 80? 90? Didn't you say he's I mean, he was since the creeping on Clausier hard. He's been I, I creeping. Think. Check this shit out. The mayor was banging some chick he wanted to bang, so we shot him. Chick's called Clausier. Clausier. As in the suspect he let escape from Kitsuragi's report. Fucking snitch being clad. Yeah, that chick. Get over it, pig. She didn't do it. It was Grandpa on the island. Mayor was fucking her, and he couldn't hack it. Kuno can hack it. <laughs> Yeah. Kudo's not jealous. Gonna give him the sniper. Okay, and he confess to the prosecution too. Um, honestly, I don't think he will. A so. and a civilian, Jean, and the gun. He has it. Okay, we'll see about it when we get Coast Guard on the island. This left a mark. They can't deny it. Yeah, good. Shut the fuck up, we Jean. Got the We're this expert detectives. They can't deny it. And there was a giant phasmid on the island. I have to believe you made a zoological discovery. <laughs> That's not a must. And even if you did, you're a cop. Who cares? You know, Harry, if I may interrupt again, it would help if you had evidence. Any proof, and I'd blame Paul here. The PR potential would be quite something for the RCM. Suit, we have a shitload of proof. Spin it on them, pig. Put the best proof forth, as solid as you've got. Um. It makes a chemical it makes it look more like the reeds. I guess that's like none of these are really proof, though. Besides, to gather the items. Where well, I know things about it. I guess, but like all these could be just made up. Besides, like the physical evidence we have, right? Yeah. Some kind of um I don't know, that's that's my that's my power? thought. Yes. Things collected for mating display. This would indicate a male, but I don't know of insects displaying Valerie behavior. She was there! Display the shit, pig! The shit! It's the proof! Okay, cool, I was right. I'm a I'm a brain genius, dude. Yeah. I just what don't know that like this is really gonna convince them, you know. I, I agree, but it's the only like solid yeah, right. thing we have to get, like the, from right. the bug. You experience it. Yeah, it's all we've got. We should have taken a fucking picture. Yeah, Kim had the camera though from the beginning of the game. Kim had the fucking camera. Everything goes back to that stupid fight. We should have never lost Kim. What if if you have Kim, you actually can take a picture? Yeah, maybe. Maybe it's true. Um, no, I know what I saw. It was real. Bugs everywhere. Plants turning into bugs. It's a typical hallucination. Every drunk past the age of 40 has seen it. You're right about that. Fucking Kuno doesn't have a photo camera because Kuno is fucking poor. Yeah. Okay. Kim would have had a camera. Like, this dialogue is Kuno saying, yeah. if I were Kim, you yeah. would have the evidence you needed. Yeah, exactly. But it's in my head. In here. Kuno's eyes took the picture. Wow, that would be kind of crazy that you have like Harry, evidence of a phasmid. Yeah. I wonder if it doesn't show up on the picture or something. Kuno, please. If it's I just would other, really like to know like how Kim reacts to that thing, you know? Yeah. It will never be seen again. It wasn't seen for a hundred years. Fuck Kuno and let's all pretend there was no miracle. We don't need <laughs> a giant insect. Everything is so good without it in this book hole. The sheer willpower in him must be making some dent in their incredulity. Some part of them must be thinking, if he is that certain, and they are not. Come on. Fuck it. I believe him. Hell yeah! Thank you, Kudo. Just, just non-stop yes. aggression. Force him in it. Don't. Kudo. We gotta just, we gotta sand this kid down a little bit. He's got some rough edges we gotta take care of. Uh, I think saying I fixed the distraction, which is probably gonna go poorly. How? It seems to be ongoing. I see red banners on the gates. Uh, I moved information between the company rep and Everard until the rep came to see that union wants war. Then she left. Go and hand the terminal over to the Claire brothers. I just told some people some things. No big deal. Sounds like you got played, Harry. 
because you were off your tits on that ghoul. I don't. That's a Batman villain, dude. It doesn't matter yeah. what we know about Al Ghul. What matters is, you're Everett Claire's peony now. Just as I said, he's a mob boss, did you know? Is that why you want us to investigate the assassination of the bravest Who is... union head thing? What is Al Ghul in the context of this Ghul? game for real, though? Don't remember in the slightest. You yeah, me neither. Again? My pig's not dirty? This is fucking paladin shit? <laughs> don't bend like that? Wow. <laughs> Uh, Kudo, yes. tell him, tell him the cops the that we have paladin brain cool. is not a good way to convince <laughs> them that we're smart. The body was transported yeah, paladins are notoriously fucking stupid. Yeah, I'm gonna go pull the whole fucking island real quick. <laughs> You're not the only cop in the world, Harry. This all comes back to us. What? I mean, I solved that case. Good work with the missing Thank person, you. detective. I solved the doomed commercial area. I don't know what the doomed commercial area is. Um... I'm gonna tell more about the black hole, I guess. No, it didn't. It didn't turn out to be anthropological again. Enough with two millimeter holes and the giant bugs. This isn't Paradox B. We're a police force. Paradox B is a fringe science magazine published. In well, it, maybe Paradox its B its sounds like my kind of magazine. Theories like yeah. telekinesis and intraisolary How before they get out of hand. What were you even doing in some commercial area? Your job was to solve a murder, not Martinez. This pig helps people, okay? Yeah. He's a fucking handy helper. He does that shit. He finds insects and solves side shit. It's his style. I like that they just call it side quests pretty consistently Jean, throughout the yeah. whole thing. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> also, Jean, Very. like Judith, Judith saying like, relax. It's his style. Come on, you know that. Yeah, I like uh, that. I found this jacket. She's like getting on our side a little bit. Yeah. Does anyone and care? even Jean started to like no get one. convinced. Yeah. He's a little See, bit less of an no asshole in the last five minutes. All right. So. No. Sure, you get the case together. You can do police work in bounds. That's not a surprise to me. Even the insect. I don't care. But you're an alcoholic and you've been drinking again. I won't let my life unravel because of this. Actually, you know, I have a thought. Uh, he might technically be right about the alcoholism drinking again, because that is how the game starts. Like, can't question, I had one sip of a beer, but the day before the game started, I had a lot more than one sip of a beer, I think, so... That's, that's true. He might be right. He has. That's true. It's tough. One of the toughest addictions to overcome. Comparable only to heavy synthetic opiates. Even morphine is easier to kick than alcohol, statistically. The odds are against him, especially at his age. He's too old. He's been like this for too long. I've seen him try many times. It's a farce by now. No, you can figure it out. Replace it. Electrochemistry Replace is saying this? Amphetamine or GBL. Fuck it. Oh. Morphine. She's just saying to get different agent. drugs. Anything. Fair enough. To buy you time. All you need is time. If you declare yourself a doomed man, a doomed man does not need comfort from anything. He can go on without drink or help. Like so, clockwork. so all hmm. of the doing of like all the solving the case, doing all the side quests, all of our dialogue choices and everything lead to this moment, which is trying not to lose our job of being a cop. For the planet, yeah. Proletaria. Stop, and you can go to the burnt-out quarter and meet me there, wafting above the burnt ruins, like the smell of caramel. Lurateur is waiting. Stop, and you can go to the burnt-out quarter and meet me there. Shiver, that's a weird thing for Shivers, I guess. Usually Shivers is like weird yeah. feelings of other people in other places doing stuff. Weird. Yeah, um, I agree. Uh... I'm gonna do what conceptualization told me to do because that was a challenging success and he knows me very yeah. well. Yeah. Listen to this That's shit, good... man! Detective, I just don't want this trial to go on any longer. It's cold outside and let's just go. Fucking Harry, fuck you for bringing this kid with you. It's only because he's defending you. It's the only reason you're not <laughs> staying here. <tonight. laughs> that's, that's actually, you know, if you think about it, there was the choice to bring Kuno along or not. 
Yeah. I wonder how bad this goes if you're by yourself. You manipulative son of a bitch. Probably bad, it you're right. Cold, and we have vehicles in the square. The perp needs to be taken into custody. Let's get a move on. We did it. We kept our job. The man looks westward. We solved the case. Patiently. Jingle Hell yeah. his car keys in his pocket. Um Yes! The Buddha Mantra! Yep. This is this is what yep. I wanted. No. Suspect seemed to think so. Table to work for mob boss. Your suicidal <laughs> area. No mob boss. Fair, fair enough. I assure you. Makes tons of sense. I wouldn't consult for a corrupt unit. Wow, that's weird that I, I want to talk to Ruby again now about that. Backpedal out of it. Weird. I told you it's not that bad. You would immediately. Yeah, I wonder why we're the can opener. Yeah. All right, who am I? Who are you? You're a gym teacher, Harry. Well, obviously you're not a gym teacher anymore, but. I'm still racking up XP. Is there like a new game Before plus I can cook, I can go into and pass every check easily? Home. It's getting really cold outside. Should we maybe? I actually don't know. I've never heard anybody talk about New Game Plus with this game, but no it does that seem like the kind of game that would have it, doesn't it? The running, the jumping, the guns on your arms, your whack mustache. <laughs> How you spin kicks the kicked out gymnast style? Yeah! yeah. I'm, gla I'm glad Kuno was watching. Also, this guy. <laughs> just everything about this guy. Oh, I thought, he was, I thought Physical Edition was talking about himself. You've been on about Mike again. I hate that guy. Um, hey! Hey! Hold on! <laughs> Good point. I didn't even process that, he, that John is saying he hates you. Don't fucking love that. Oh, you don't say. Does he also vault an impassable gulf of finance and privilege? It is... It is getting cold out. Uh, when was In that, Jim Teacher? In the 20s teacher? or late 20s. Okay, so it's, it's been a, it's been a hot minute. Since then. Yeah, that's true. Yes, you told Jim in cool. I believe that's the term. Told Jim in nice. high school. You were a high school cool. gym teacher. The smell of sweat and glue. The worn floorboards. Kuro is just east of Jarrow. It was a short walk every morning to the baseball field or the sports building. The regular. You found some chick. She inspired you to fight the big fight. Be more than you are. Hold and that turned out great. You. Every morning. Walking from Voyager Road to teach Jim. She, leaving for the academy with her spring coat on. The air filled with the smell of smoke. The academy of becoming a incredible. demigod. What what academy? They have those. That makes sense. They have those. There has to be something wrong if you can run like that. <laughs> All right, why am I like this? <laughs> it's not a mystery. Some chick fucked you over. Also, you were drunk. Hey, he's so blunt, <laughs> man. <laughs> Really maximized the damage. Dora something. Dora England. Yeah, you mentioned her name. Something like that. Have Vasa. Dora England. Vasa is where beautifully and impossibly blonde people come from. So she was hot, though. No one is married anymore. This is Revachol. Huh. God, I don't well, know. I, you know, at least I was ago, calling her my girlfriend wife and not my wife. My or maybe I called her my wife. Don't, don't call me out. <laughs> Six years and you haven't gotten over it. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> this is three. Let's go with three. No, it was six. Like ancient. It's an old man thing. Two old years equals one normal year. That and Dora England really tore you a new one. A big one. Incredibly bangable. <laughs> wow. That's her wow. defining okay. characteristic to you. Jesus. She was extremely fuckable, Harry. Gorgeous, a gorgeous bourgeois woman, wavyish, like a welkin, basically. <gasps> we know what those wow. are. Wow, fucking welkin. nerd. Pain welkin. I Pain welkin. Her. Pain elf. It's obvious you Pain a elf. Spiritual connection with how pretty she was. When It'd be a fucking pain elf. From. Look, the sun is about to go down. It's time to go. I think she taught in the Academy des Arts, east of the river, way east. Hard to say which came first, the middle class chick or the drink. Egg and the chicken kind of thing. <laughs> My point is, you need to see a psychiatrist about this shit. Not a psychologist. Several degrees harder. Is there something harder than a psychiatrist? A forensic psychiatrist? Go talk to that. In other words, he's heard enough about this. Alright, uh, let's uh, learn about the Us? station, I guess? With the bloody murder station, haven't you heard? With the bad guys. 
No one likes us. Really? What? Bitches dream of the 41st? Why do you think Kuno's in this shit? Where it is, it's fucking violent. Your Captain Price just did like Okay, people. Kuno, I think you got the wrong impression you, about why you're being cut. Someone would want to it's an the, understaffed the station force. and the district is too big, which is why we need to get back to it. We left Torso and then McLean to run the ceiling. It's not good. Uh Torso Mac McLean. The Torso Torson and Chester McLean. They're not fit to run a wing. Believe me. Things are shaky as it is. They are damn Fair. iconic though. Torson and McLean. Oh yeah, the iconic yeah, duo. Not like us. That is a real Too cop duo name for sure. What's the fucking? I'm like losing my mind right now. I can't remember the name of the guy from Die Hard. It's something McLean. Die Ron? Hard. That's Ron. Ron McLean, maybe. It's not no, Ron fucking McLean is a Ron. Ron, Ron McLean is an announcer for Hockey Night in Canada. That's why I said Ron McLean. Um, oh God. Don. Don? <laughs> no, it's C and D. <laughs> We're in C. McLean. It's made of losers and clock punchers. McLean. You and I, I reconceptualized I, it as a task force. I need my encyclopedia to catch John. In it's John McLean. Thank you. Also I was fucking close. I assume you had to Google it because no one on Earth could have known that off the top of their head. Oh, absolutely I did. Yeah, 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 yeah. Nobody's Tony seen Price Die Hard. He's the son of the old Price, one of the founders of the RCM. Yeah, that shit is fucking famous on Channel 8. Kudo hears this shit. We recently shoot up a church. So he remembers that. Yes, there may have been a raid on some churches. That's it not. Wasn't good press. That's not a good look. Shooting yeah. up churches never is. I was out of town, to be clear. <laughs> Trent, fuck off. Our enemies were hiding in a church, to the best of our information. Hey, yes. Zay. I'm yeah. not talking about this anymore. I'm gonna ask you a question. It's not gonna make sense to our viewers, but I am just gonna ask it now, anyways. Okay, go for what it. was the game that we played where we always talked about going to Nakatomi Plaza? Dude, that was just any game. It was, it was, there was no bit there. It was just saying, it's it's probably, it's probably, Plaza, dude. It's probably just it's any game? Okay. For some reason, I thought it's an old it was an actual specific maybe game like, that we were playing. Maybe like PUBG, but I think even after PUBG, Could honestly. be PUBG. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. All right. Well, that was a fun, fun trip down memory lane just for the two of us. It's divided into 11 districts. Jamrock only as us. Kuno's liking this shit. Jamrock is the real shit. Kuno's gonna become a cop. Fucking white as balls. Yeah. That's why he broke up with Kuno up. ass. Thank Which, you, like, we kind of glossed over because there was a lot of dialogue happening. But good for Kuno. You know? Yeah, she was she was a bad seed. Kuno, you you, did yeah. a, you made a wise choice. Yeah, you're better for it, Kuno. You'll be okay. Who is Lena? She lives at one 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 three. Oh yeah, we got her address so we can tell her about it. Yeah. Hell yeah. It actually paid off. We were just trying to be nice. Damn, if only Kim was here with a fucking picture though, she would have been absolutely pogged out of her mind. Yeah, she would have lost her mind. If we're gonna drop you off anyway. Alright, cool. Fuck do you think? Gonna rock that law enforcement shit with you guys? Detective Kuno? Like you promised? Did I promise that? Like you promised. Kuno, yeah, just put, I, Kuno, put him Kuno in, should be a junior just, officer, absolutely. Yeah, get him in there. No, Jam, not, not Jamrock, well. Martinez needs them. Kuno's fucking 19? 19! He's to be 15 for the junior officer program. He's You're 19, dude, that's old enough. Hey. We're gonna make a junior, junior, oh, officer program. Kuno smells of bacon grease? Being seen with you, fucking informant shit. You think no one sees this? They're gonna hang me by the nuts if you leave me here. You want that on you, a dead kid? Or you want Kuno at your station solving shit? Like Jean, we just did. I want Kuno at our station solving this shit. Uh, he was good. Actually, like he was like surprisingly helpful yeah. multiple times. I don't care. Yeah. He can't be a cop. He's 12 <laughs> and says every four seconds. That's a good, that's a good point. John's got one point. He's cleansed him, he's fixed. Uh -oh. Maybe you can take the kid with you. Enroll him a year earlier and say he's 14. If he... I promise I won't say it. I, I won't say any of it anymore. Oh, oh my god. god. For God's sake. Yes, we'll do it. Yes! Wow! We fixed Kuno! I got an achievement! Secret ta I got Secret task solved. I got an got achievement. achievement. You probably can't see it, so I'm, this, I'm looking at the Steam overlay right now. Recruit Detective 
Kuno, his full, his actual name. Kuno de Rutar, Ruter, something like that. It's his wow. actual full Kuno name. We got an achievement and fucking completed it. secret task for 5 XP. Make Kuno not a uh, bigot anymore. Hell we did yes. it. Fuck wow. It. Let's go. We fucking Trump did it. His motor carriage. It's a 20 minute drive to Jamrock. Under the afternoon sky, the great well, I, district I, hums. I guess I, I, a chessboard of wooden houses. Actually, was correct. When I said when this dialogue tree ends, friends, we're gonna get credits. When I got on the boat. Yeah, this. Yeah, I think this is the end of the game. Forty-one to Boogie Street, forking into the snow-swept horizon. You close your eyes and hear the dogs bark. A lone woman sits by a factory window, dreaming of meteorite strikes. On Rue de saint jerome a square bullet slides into a square-shaped chamber. In Old South, a man without eyelids... Do I know any smiles. of these things this fucking guy's rap? Spring has come. <laughs> it's time. Torsen? Yes. McLean? Yes. Heidelstam? No. Vic Mayer? What? Yes. Did I don't know what that was. We're voting for something? Yes. Really? Nick Scott Lee looks up from the list. I hear he's unstable. You say that like it's a bad thing. Captain Potomney Price gestures with a ballpoint pen. It's dim in his office, and the curtains are drawn. Harry's our man. He'll pull through. When he does, did it. he'll side with the people. Wow. Understood. Gottlieb returns to the list. Minna, of course. Wonderful. Then can we please just go back to Jamrock now? Well, look at that end. We did it. What, what, Kuno, what are you doing? Can you just give him a salute, I think? He didn't touch the door when he opened it. Is he gonna, didn't have to. Is he gonna be floating outside the car? <laughs> please, oh my god, please. that would be so funny. So we never finished the task to get the... He just opened that door through his face. <laughs> yeah, normal. Whatever, at least we can't see him anymore, so it's probably fine. Uh, um... We never finished the task to get the full suit of armor. So I wonder, I, I mean, yeah. my thoughts are maybe it's a fake task you can't actually complete, or like, I wonder if you can, like, miss, we miss it somehow. Maybe if we had survived the gunfire, we could have, like, That's what I'm thinking. What if, what if we, that's what I was thinking. What, whoa, title card! Oh, shit. We did it. The game's about to begin. We, f we fucking did it. Wow. All right. There's no, uh, there's no skip credits game. button, so I guess we're gonna sit here, wait for it. Yeah! Just sit here and kind of talk. I, I think, um, it did a lot of things really well. I was actually thinking about this earlier today, but, I, I don't remember if I even said this, I might have, but it actually pays off, like, kind of what I wanted from Mass Effect in a weird way, where, like, the promise of Mass Effect is like, oh, your decisions matter, and then they, they, they fucking didn't at all. Whereas with this game, like, Basically, like, well, not every, but the vast majority of dialogue options that you pick, like, actually do matter in the dialogue trees and come up later in ways you would not ever expect, but, like, fit and were really cool to see. And uh, that shit Yeah, was really I agree. Cool. Yeah, I think Mass Effect, or I think, like, you know, whenever I think about, like, Telltale games and stuff like that, like, lots of... Walking Dead in particular is the Telltale game that I played all the way through, and lots of the decisions in that game were, like, superficial at best, yeah. it felt like. They don't uh, matter at all. But Absolutely. they, yeah. But even the superficial ones here, like, paid off much and, better than and like Mass Effect. And maybe like they don't have much of an impact on the ending. And it's a, it, honestly, it's a little bit of a bummer to me how much of the like, um, like the conflict with the Mercs, like those skill checks, are like compared to all the other skill checks in the game, like seem like disproportionately affected of like how the final parts here play out. If that makes sense, like not having mm -hmm. Kim here, and it was a bit of a bummer. Even though Kuno was fun, I liked having his commentary was fun. Um, so so it, it does it does disappoint me a little bit that we we failed a bunch of those in a row, which made that ending, which made that part not go well. Um, yeah, I I I I liked that. Um, they managed to make the decisions pay off through the entire game, but you still do get that kind of end conversation where you get to recap everything you did. I will say that, like, I feel a little weird. It, it's kind of weird to me that the solution of the case just ends up being, like, 
there was just an old guy on the island yeah. who just shot him with a sniper it, rifle. I, so I, I, have two, I have two things I want to say about what you just said. The first about like that ending conversation being like, let's sum up all the actions you did, and then it just like, I feel like I should have gotten a bad ending. He listed like five things yeah. in a row that were all like shit that I did that was not good for like being a, a cop, being a detective, which are like, I don't think I made the wrong decision, but or that character's perspective and the other cops there, they should have been like, no, like, fuck you, you're not, you're not coming back on the force. So it's a little bit weird that despite that, we were able to succeed there anyway. Um, and maybe that's because, like, we did a bunch of the side stuff and, like, Kuno was backing us up and stuff, but, yeah. Also, to your point, yeah, like, the, the guy that, who did it, like, this kind of ties into, like, my full criticism of the game, I guess, is, like, they clearly put a fucking ton of work into, like, developing and fleshing out this setting and, like, the history of it and, like, so much work beyond, like, what they would need to do to, like, tell a story, like, as, like, a game story, if that makes sense. Um, but honestly, I thought a lot of the, like, history of Martinet and, like, the different political factions stuff, like, I thought that stuff was, like, pretty fucking dry and definitely wasn't the thing about the story that interests me the most so it was a bit of a bummer that like the the guy who did it like the main antagonist of the story that caused all the events to take place was just like kind of the culmination of that through line if that makes sense well um, yeah and the thing the thing that i find weird about that too is that like whatever you have to say about like the effectiveness of that particular plot line like we get to that guy at the end and there was really no hint that there was going to be a guy living there and we still ended up with like an hour and a bit of fucking just exposition dialogue with that dude to yeah. basically explain how things went and it feels like if they were gonna do that they could have at least like peppered some of that throughout the rest of but the what's the thing? Game. I already knew how the conflict went. We already knew everything that he told us. Like, there wasn't any new revel yeah. revelations or anything like that. It was exactly. just, like, how he felt about the war. And it's like, that guy could have easily just been a different side character you met earlier in the game who hated everyone else living in the city. And, like, that he would have been just as effective of, like, a criticism of, like, city politics and stuff. So, like, yeah. yeah. And and maybe we'll get a thousand comments that are like, actually, you totally can meet that guy. And that wouldn't surprise me, but I, I, I don't know. Cool, but I, I doubt it. It felt yeah. very railroady into not letting us meet him early until I let us ride the boat to me. I agree. Um, not, oh, I just like... I wanted to finish my, uh, my metaphor of comparing it to Mass Effect, where it paid off the small details of Mass Effect really well, but I feel like the ending actually had the same issues as Mass Effect 3's ending, where Mass Effect's story revolved around, like, three or four main, like, different threats moving the plot forward, and, like, existential issues with the entire setting, and then the ending hyper-focused on just the one of the, like, AI getting intelligence, which, mm -hmm. that was the least interesting plot element of Mass Effect to me. So to have this one be entirely, like, fixated on the, like, communist philosophy with the ending, just, it, it, I, I honestly I just I was not that interested in that character at all, and like having the Phasma show up was really cool. But at the same time, I thought it was a little bit like I don't want to say kind of disappointing to be like, oh yeah, also the Phasma was just here the whole time and like rotting his brain. It felt a little like unnecessary, I guess. I don't know. And that's like a, that's not a substantive that's... criticism, obviously, but it felt weird to have this like thing that was like a side plot through the whole game. It was like. Oh, actually, it was important. Just, I, I can really get behind that as a plot device, but when it's like a weird bug, it feels a little weird to me. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, I agree. Um, I think in my situation, that actually saved that conversation for me because I was so bored oh, listening to I that agree. guy by the end of it. <laughs> I agree, and it was it was a cool reveal. It just felt like odd. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I don't disagree. But I also, I, um, I, that was definitely the best part of that whole sequence, so. For sure. Um, I'm surprised that, I, I feel like I'm just, uh, just talking about all my criticisms of this game, so it is worth noting that I actually think this credits. is like a really oh, good, yeah, like, really, yeah, really, it was, really good game. A, there's a lot of things that this game does better than basically any other game I played, probably. <laughs>
Yeah. Um, I think it's... I, I, I do just sort of think it's weird that, like, the Ruby... The whole, the whole Ruby side plot, like, was basically nothing. Like, yeah. you went down this entire rabbit hole chasing this Ruby character, and the eventuality of it was, like, we get into a cave, she hits us with a radio wave, and then leaves. And we just, like, kind of know she was maybe... Well, she was running drugs. And also, I guess she tells us the puta madre thing, which I guess which it turns out is matter. not true. Yeah. Yeah. Which is a bummer. Like, that, that was actually really interesting to me, to, like, totally redefine the character. Yeah. Um, now, it was, fu it was uh, sort of, like, kind of funny slash good in its own way. Um, it may be realistic, I guess, for, it to, for you to, like, chase down a there's a stress relief person in the credits just now that's just the dog they just listed the dog in the credits for being <laughs> stress relief while making this game um it is kind of neat to like have it have you like chase down a lead that ultimately like was deep but completely fucking unrelated but then it just didn't feel like it actually paid off into anything like ruby yeah. was like I, I, yeah like actually it's if you think about like how you solve this case all you do is you go to the room you use visual calculus to track where the bullet came from you go to each spot and that's the end of the game like if you could actually just do that you could beat the game in five minutes so that's nothing else actually mattered to the case which is like yeah i don't really like that as a mystery writing i understand why like there might be thematic reasons to do that but i'm not a huge fan but um yeah. do you want to real quick run back and uh Go get those, go see how we pass those mercs. See if we can save Kim. Zay, I do want to do that. 